collectors, kids of all ages. Well, this video today is about uh, me sharing all my uh, Tony Stark head sculpts. I have five of them of uh, the original Hot Toys Iron Man. And uh, I'll start off with the first one that I've ever purchased, which was the Tony Stark uh, mech test version, which is in, back there in the right, suspended in the air. And then, of course, my second version, which I can't remember which suit the head sculpt's from. It's right here in the front. It's my custom, uh, my custom Tony Stark uh, with the donuts and the sunglasses, which is my actually favorite hair sculpt, not head sculpt hair sculpt and then of course my uh, third version uh, purchase excuse me it's the mark one second edition sideshow exclusive and then my going on my fourth version which was the mark seven which i purchased about a month ago and it was the exclusive sideshow one but what i did was um i did a little business transaction and i got the regular version and that's that and i wish i could have gotten the uh was that the battle damage? But you know what? This is okay too. I mean, I, I can deal with this. This is the Avengers, and this goes with the Avengers, and it looks great, this Mark 7. And I'm gonna actually put all the battle damage stuff on it, and it uh, looks terrific. And then, of course, the Iron Man 3, which is amazing. Really, pre <laughs> really great looking figure. The body, I can't even tell you how awesome that is. That's just like amazing they put, how they put all that together. Um, yeah, my favorite head sculpt has to be, oh, well, hair sculpt, let's go hair sculpt, it's got to be him right here, my custom, um, just, I, I don't know, just, he looks just very cool, he looks like all the time Tony Stark in the movies, I just, you know, just has that one expression which really captures him very, very well, now, mind you, um, the Tony Stark Iron Man 3, I love his hair also. That's my second favorite. And I love his expression. I love the intensity and the look. The Mark 7 Avengers one is just not... I don't like that smirk. I mean, it just bothers me. I don't know. Just, meh. You know, it doesn't do it for me at all. And um, looking back at the, uh, you know, the Tony Stark mech test version, that head sculpt is, was fantastic. I love the goatee on it. Really pretty. And, uh, I mean, pretty in the sense, like, it's really, you know, shaven really nice, you know. It looks really good. The whole hair, the hair on the face, and, you know, it looks really, really, really nice. A lot of work went into that, I guess, that sculpt, and, uh, but it's not as, as good as the newer versions. But it's still a nice version. And, of course, you know, this armor, if you don't have this, this is, oh my god, this is a beast. The Mark One. I. I mean, I'm so happy I, uh, they re-released it. I would not. I, I mean, I wouldn't pay what people were asking for. But um, I, I, you know, on, e on Evil Bay, <laughs> there's no way I would pay the, um, the amount of money that um, people were asking for it. But I'm so happy that um, Hot Toys actually did a second version of it, and uh, it's um, amazing. So the next head sculpt that's coming out, that's flashing in the background, you may not see it behind the. Uh, Avengers Mark 7 is actually the Hot Toys website, and that's the mechanic. And that looks pretty good. That looks nice. Um, it looks like the same hair sculpt as the... And it looks like the same head sculpt almost as uh, the Iron Man 3 uh, version there. But, you know, it is what it is. I probably you guys may pick it up, and some of you guys may be like, oh, I'm tired of Iron Man. So anyway, I'm going to get a little, uh, do a little uh, close-up on him. The, yeah, my, my video camera may, uh, going into focus may blur, but it, I'll straighten it out in a second, and I'll just give you from one to five as I started, and I'll start with the uh, Meg Test version, and uh, you'll get a little bit of a close-up on the face, which is pretty amazing. Hope that's good and clear. That's one. And my second one here, which I think is my favorite. Yeah, that's pretty nice. And and listen to this. Listen to this. Coincidentally, I'm looking for a purple shirt for my banner figure. And there it is. So I'm gonna switch it up. And I got myself a shirt. So that's I just saved some bucks because I do have other color shirts. I can put like a real cool one on this one. Anyway, enough about that. But I'm so happy I just saved myself some money. And uh, let's go to the, um, the 
I think this is one of the best suits. This is amazing. Detail on the suit. It's awesome. I love, love, love the way it looks like it's made out of metal and then the, the uh, welding beads all over it. It just looks fucking primo. And let's get to the Mark 7, which I'm going to have to do a little review of this guy. This guy is... See, I just don't like that smirk. I don't know. I don't know if a lot of guys like that, but smirk just uh, doesn't do it for me. And then, of course, but the suit is awesome. The armor, the the whole body on it, it's, it's fantastic. It's fantastic. And then, of course, the latest one. Um, this one is a beast. I mean, this is, like, terrific. Can't even complain about it. It's just awesome. Really pretty head sculpts. All of them. Always Hot Toys is doing primo jobs on all these uh, great figures that they, they produce and come out with. Just amazing work on all of them. And uh, I think they've done like, spectacular jobs. But um, anyway, so I just wanted to share my uh, Hot Toys Tony Stark head sculpts. All original, of course, you know, none of the uh, the bogus ones that you get on eBay from other uh, companies and stuff like that. These are all the hot toy versions that I've gotten, and I think they're uh, primo. All right, so enough about this, and on to the next video that's coming soon. Boys and girls, stay tuned always on my channel, and if you haven't sub sub, then uh, if you haven't given me a thumbs up in a couple of days, Feel free to do so. It won't cost you anything, but just make it feel good, making me feel good. And you know how I always say, boys and girls, I know you don't like me, but you like my style.